Magic Tech Review. How are you guys doing today? And in today's video, I just want to tell you guys about an Apple lawsuit that apparently Apple lost and they're actually going to have to pay out. Uh, they're actually going to have to pay out to us. So everybody on this live stream right now, I'm going to have the link in the description down below. And you can literally put in your serial number to the phone that you use. I'm going to tell you the details, which phones are you know, actually being able to be, uh, you know, used for this lawsuit or whatever. And I'm going to give you just guys a little bit of a background about what's going on or whatever. So you guys basically know back in the day or whatever, or not even back in the day, it was a couple of years ago now, that they were slowing down iPhones, right? Somebody just noticed it out of the blue that they were slowing down iPhones. Hey, what's going on? What's going on, BSWT? What's going on, KZ? So, yeah, so basically this is just a, you getting free money. You getting free money. Magic's just letting you know about free money, how to get how to get it. So let me actually get into the uh, topic right here. Let me get into the article. So it's a big article, big thing going on right now. They they have a list going on right now. So basically uh, they, they have settled up to $500 million, up to $500 million in, uh, in settlement damages. So let's go ahead and. I'm just gonna share this out to uh, to my peeps real quick on Discord, and then uh, we'll go ahead and get started with that. But let's see here. What's up, man? You're gonna get the LG Stylo Six. Hey, oh, what's up, Marlo? Okay, Marlo's here. All right, so I don't even have to do that. But let's see here. Let me see. Let me share this out. Share this out real quick. Boom, boom, boom. Then I can get into the, the topic at hand. And then I'll put the link in the description below. But I'm definitely going to do it because I have an iPhone SE. I have an iPhone SE that that I have actually just right up here. Where is that thing? iPhone SE, the old one. You know what I'm saying? So I have this one. And it, it qualifies. So I will be getting my little, my little uh, check. From Apple, so I, I think that all of you should actually do this as well. That are watching this video, I think it's it's twenty five dollars per device. So and you can have multiple devices. All right, so it's not clickbait. You're actually going to be getting free money from Apple, um, and then I think they're going to be doing. They're going to actually be hearing the case. Uh, they're going to be hearing the case later on. So it's not like le legit like right now, but you can put in to it. How's your state dealing with the uh, pandemic? Uh, we're doing all right. I mean, I'm going to classes. I'm going. To, I'm, I'm literally going to classes Monday through Thursday. I'm going Monday through Thursday, so we're doing all right with the with the whole the, the whole pandemic thing or whatever. Uh, let's see here. So case number eighteen dash MD dash two eight two seven dash EJD whatever. If you were if you are or were a U.S. owner of an iPhone six. 6 Plus, 6S, 6S Plus, or SE device that ran iOS 10.21 or later before December 21st, 2017, and or U.S. owner of an iPhone 7, 7 Plus device that ran 11.2 or later before December 21st, 2017, you couldn't be entitled to it to benefits under a class <laughs> action settlement. All right, important dates, October 6, 2020. Request for exclusion from for settlement must be received by this date. So you can actually also on this website, you can actually also uh, exempt yourself. All right. So if you exempt yourself from receiving uh, from receiving said benefit or whatever, you know, because they're going to give everybody a little bit of something, something or whatever, you know. So everybody that puts into this, they're going to give you a little something. All right. Now, from what I heard, it's twenty five dollars up to fifty dollars or something. It's not going to be a lot, guys. All right. You know, they slow down your phone, boo-boo. Now, if you want to actually... And little, John, little John's hyped right now. So he's hyped about getting his check from Apple. Uh, so objections to the settlement must be... So if you so if you exclude yourself, that means you want to go ahead and sue Apple yourself. All right? So if you want to go ahead and get your lawyers and get your team up and go there or whatever and sue Apple yourself, then you can go ahead and sue Apple yourself. And, you know, if you want to try to get more money... Uh, objections to the settlement must be delivered or received by October 6, 2020. 
Objections to class counsel's request for attorney fees and expenses must be delivered, received by this date, October 6, 2020. Claim forms must be submitted online by this date or received by this date, uh, October 6, 2020. So basically, October 6, 2020 is the day you're going to have to, like, yo, you're going to have to go ahead and, um, you're basically just going to go ahead and have to have your stuff in. All right. Mill Hustles. What's up, Mill Hustles? What's going on, bro? So December 4th, 2020 is the fairness hearing. So they're actually going to go ahead and do this all over again. They've already agreed. It says under the proposed settlement, Apple will make a minimum, minimum non-reversionary payment of $310 million. That's million, right? Yeah, that's million. And a maximum payment of up to $500 million, depending on the number of claims submitted. All right. So it's a maximum of $500 million and a minimum of $310 million. Now, they know they slowed down all these iPhones. They know their hands are dirty. And this proves right here that they actually did wrong. And they're going to, some, some, you know, compensate us. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever the case may be. You may be entitled to settlement benefits if you are or were a United States owner of iPhone 6, 6S Plus, blah, 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 blah. That ran iOS 10 point, you know, you can read, you can read this here. It says your legal rights are affected whether you act or don't act. Please read the, this note, the notice carefully. All right. So you have options, you know, this is option one, submit a claim form online or in the mail. So you can literally just, you can literally just go ahead and go right here and you literally click, boom. You can either do it in, in, in by snail mail, which I don't know who's going to do that. And this is the only way to get a payment under the settlement, all right? It, you can exclude yourself, all right? This is another option. You, you, you can exclude yourself, and the debt, all the deadlines are October 6, 2020, all right? Get no payment. So if you exclude yourself, get no payment under the settlement. This is the only option that allows you to be a part of any other lawsuit against Apple about the claims and allegations in this case. So if you want to do, like, your own separate thing, or if you got, you know, a lot of people that you want to do, or... You know, maybe you got a whole, I don't know, company, uh, whatever the case may be, you can go ahead and do your own thing. Object to the settlement. You can write to the court about why you don't like the settlement and ask to speak at the final hearing. So I don't know who's going to be able to speak at the final hearing. That's going to be a cluster, you know, a cluster bomb. You can object to attorney's fees and or expensive expenses. So write to the court about why you don't like the attorney fees or expenses that class counsel requests. You can go to the hearing, so uh, speak in court about the fairness of the settlement. That's on December 4th, 2020 at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So if you would like to go to the said hearing, I would love to go to the hearing if I had the chance, you know, if I was, uh, you know, in the area or whatever they're doing or whatever, I would love to go to the hearing. I would love to, I would just love to, to go there and see, and see them quivering and, you know, actually, you know, giving in or whatever. Or you can do nothing, obviously. Get no payment under the settlement. And give up your right to compensation for the claims and allegations in this case. So thank you to Mill Hustles because he donated that iPhone SE. And I'm going to go ahead and use the serial number to go ahead and claim the $25 because of my pain. And so, I don't know if it's $25. I keep saying $25. I think I read it somewhere that $25. So don't quote me. But my Mill Hustles, my pain and suffering that I got from this phone from being slowed down. Is uh, you know what I'm saying really really hurt me. Uh, these rights and options and the deadlines to exercise them are explained in the notice. The court in change of this case uh, still must decide whether to approve the settlement. Payments will be made if the court approves the settlement after appeals are resolved. Please be patient. What's up? Uh, what's up, Saint Cloud Pousey? How are you doing? I haven't seen you on YouTube anymore. Yeah, I've just been slowing down, bro. It's been really hot. Little John's not in school, so it's kind of hard for me to make videos. You know, he'd be hyped all the time, you know, crying, this, that, and the third. So I try to wait for him to be, you know, be kind of quiet, chilled out, or whatever. So it is what it is. But now that I'm going to school, hopefully Little John will go to school, and then I'll be able to make more videos, you know. So it just, it is what it is, brother. Uh, but thank you guys for who, whoever is here. Uh, whenever you do submit a claim, all right, if you go right up there, if you want to go submit a claim, it says if you know the serial number of your iPhone 6, 6 Plus, 6S, 6S Plus, 
SC7 or 7 plus, please enter here. So you can enter your serial number. You can literally just go ahead and enter your serial number. I know it's not gonna, it's not gonna go, but all right. So you can enter your serial number right there. And it says you can find your serial number on your iPhone in settings, general about. Uh, if you no longer have the, your iPhone, you can check the barcode on your device's original packaging or refer to original receipt or invoice. All right? They can do that. <coughs> Little John, we can get behind you, buddy. All right. If you do not know the serial number. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Huh? You want to show You want to look at everybody? Look. Mwah. You want to say hi to Grandma? Because Grandma's going to watch this. Look. Say hi, Grandma. Oh, Little John's growing up, man. He's growing up, guys. Ah, 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 ah. He's 10 years old now. No, little John. No, 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 no. Okay. So basically, that's all in all. Everything, um, everything that. See now he's 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 focused on the phone. So now I gotta try to keep him away from the phone. But all right. So anyways, that's about it, guys, for the video. Thank you guys for joining me live and everything like that. Uh, I'll be trying to make more videos and whatnot. Like I said, I gotta wait for little John to be calm um, because he basically goes for the phone now, not like before. <laughs> What's up, buddy? See, he's, he's all right. Once he loses his focus and he goes to the, something else, then, you know, it's all right. But that's why I don't like to make the videos like that no more. But I uh, said so I'm going to submit a claim in an hour from now. Okay. Uh, Mikey Tech Reviews. Let me know, guys. Whoever submits a claim, let me know how it goes or whatever. Um, you know what I'm saying? Let me know how it goes in the comments down below. Let me know if uh, your claim goes through okay or whatever. And then, obviously, we'll just keep in touch with all that. But... down below if you're able to submit the claim um if you were able to submit the claim and everything like that and how it goes all right guys thank you guys for watching john from magic tech review and i'll see you guys in the next one ah. all right bye bye guys <laughs> <laughs>